Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we are Let's Play Super Tactics. In the last episode, we defeated Bus Group on Alio, and now we're listening to him talk about some sort of patriarchal faction. The patriarchal faction? What the hell is that? What in the world are you talking about? Yeah. Uh, never mind. Fall back on the double! Yes, sir. Yeah, so this bus fella... Looks like they're juggling a few problems of their own. Yeah. Well, no point wasting our time worrying about all that political drama. We should be worrying about the rune cannon they're setting up here. Talk about deja vu! Sure. You're right. This is a unilateral breach of the ceasefire agreement between the island nations and the Kuluk. Yeah, they, if they find out... We must return to Obel and report this to King Lino. Kiro, could I ask you to wait here? Sure. We must return to report the current situation. We'll also request reinforcements. Nice. Fine. Let's meet at this spot again. Alright. We'll take our leave now. Farewell. Alright, thanks. Hey! Wait up, Mizuki! Well, I gotta go too. See you soon! Busy little bees, aren't they? Oh, looks like we can't Carol, use them. Perhaps for a we bit. should consider scouting the area. Yeah, what the hell? We might as well. That's what I was thinking. Let's check out the town nearby. Maybe we'll find out more there. Yeah, hopefully. I hope so. Sounds fun. I'm in too. All right, so now we are going to start exploring the Kuluk Empire. As you remember in Sukuden Four. Al Eel is uh, actually the uh, lowest area of uh, the Kuluk Empire, the southernmost tip. So yeah, this is the Al Eel Empire here. Pretty cool, right? And now from here we can actually go to the island nations, or we can enter uh, Al Eel. So let's enter. Well, there's really nothing here right now. So let's just depart. And let's head, uh... The ruins of, uh, Col Columbal and then Merceto. Oh, you know what we can do now that we're, uh... Now that we're here... We can go back over here... To the Pirates Fort, or the Nest of Pirates. Now, the thing about the Nest of Pirates is... If you... Depending on which day you go here, you'll get two different characters. So we're hitting it on wind. Let's just go in. Enter the nest of pirates. So yeah, if you enter on wind and water... Oh no, wind and earth. Wait, what the hell is that? Wind or Earth, you'll get uh, Dario and Nalo. They'll join you, and then later on, we'll be able to come. Uh, we'll we'll be able to uh, pick up. Uh, yeah, we need everyone that we can. Let's go. What about Sigurd and the others? Yeah, we'll get Sigurd and Herbie if we come back. And so yeah, that's always good. And let's depart. And let's head off to. Eventually, we'll be able to do quests even in the Kuluk Empire, so we don't have to keep coming back here. But let's find that one Welcome. that we need, that dress. These are the quests we have. Give us a sign. What the hell do they want? Get a rainbow shell. Giant crab on the deserted island. Do I already have? I might already have one. So this is a quest dis dispatch. Let me see, what the hell was it? You needed 20 strength. Which actually Dario might have. I'll have to look. The flower of Ilia. You accept that quest? Yeah, let's accept it. 
great. We're count we already got a one piece. Shop clerk, we need someone with 12. A magic of 12. And let's report. What do you have to report? I didn't go and buy it. I, I, uh, I went and stole it. Well, dug it up. I'll be like a dirty dress. Anyways, if we come to the end, we can talk with Ryan back. And he's looking for the rose crest. What the hell is I gonna do? Oh yeah, let's check. Let's go to the caravan and see what Dario's stats look like. Probably not 20 strength. No, 15 though. Pretty close. He's probably the closest one with the met that strength. He's got 15 magic. Anyone got 12 men? Flair's got 12 magic. Can I send her? Yeah, shop clerk wanted. I can send Flair. Yeah, sc screw Maxine. Shit, she's only got eight. And she's a goddamn mage. I'll send Flair. Oh, no, you can't send Flair. Let's, let's just double check. Can I send Flair? Welcome. I don't think you can send her because she's a... a uh, One of them characters you gotta keep. Nope. Twelve. Magic at eleven. Yeah, no. Can't send no one yet. Come again. Alright, we're done. I wonder, let me see if I take on let's see if I have a rainbow shell. I'm sorry, I I am such a Let's see, do I have a rainbow shell? I have a giant crab shell, it's not the same thing. You know what, we'll come back. Let's just keep heading towards Merceto and the Kuluk uh, region. Yeah, so it's been many a month since we've been here. Well, you know. To the Kuluk Empire. I like how they do that. No, I don't want to end it. Well, actually, let's let's rest and see what happens. Is there anything new we're going to see here? Nope. See, with the new game plus, you can actually skip scenes and stuff, which is kind of nice. So, let us depart. To Merceto. Uh oh. Look at this place. Hmm. Who are these guys? Uh -huh. What is it? Those men. There's something about their looks that makes me feel a little uneasy. Yeah, what is it? <laughs> Look like shady people, just that like it says. That bird didn't even realize what happened, and I ran right into her, too. It's her own fault for loafing around Merceto like that. She was asking for it. Hmm, I don't know what they're talking about. Who cares? Hurry up and open it. Oh ho, a necklace! Uh-oh. Looks like it'll fetch a good price. Like you'd have any idea. Huh. Shut it! That is if you want to keep your tongue. Anything else in there? Nah, that's all. What? Hmm. That was a waste of time. Huh? Wait, there's a piece of paper. You better mean potch paper. Ooh, potch is paper. Looks like a I letter. Thought it was, Let's see I what it says. I thought it was coins. My beautiful Miranda, every time we meet, the sadness on your face pierces my heart like a blade. Ooh, someone's in love with Miranda. <laughs> what a wuss! Wait, wait, there's more. I can't leave you to wither any longer. With him, your soul will die. Come live with me, I beg you. 
My proposal may seem sudden, but I can no longer bury my feelings for you. I must be with you. Damn. I await you in Caleron. Slip away with your daughter, but make sure he does not find out. From your devoted servant. That's the end. Wow. Wow. That's some hot and heavy stuff. Kind of stirs something deep down. <laughs> Keep your stirrings to yourself, moron. Love letters won't feed this belly. Let's hurry up and sell that necklace. Big belly. Huh? Hmm. Finally noticed us. Huh? Where'd they come from? Should we take them out? I think you should, right? I'm in. That necklace won't bring much on its own. Maybe they'll take Jan's fur or something. Anyways, now we gotta defeat some baddies. Let's change up our member list. Who can't die? All these guys can die. I guess I'll use these guys. I don't think I... I'm just gonna use Renee because I like to... There might be some treasure or something. So, um... Actually... Let's add a Mega Medicine. There we go, let's start this battle. Oh, that Tristan goes pretty quick. Hit by everybody. Oh! Look at these guys. Is there some. some. Looks like there's water over here. There's wind elemental, which is good for, uh. for whomever. What's her name? or something, so it's water uh, elemental. And I'm just gonna move out of here. Man, there's a lot of dudes. Treasure over here, is there? And I don't mean like treasure for Renee, I'm talking about treasure just in general. Look. Oh, there is. Alright, so eventually I gotta get over there. I'm just gonna move back here and dig. Oh, looks like I'm getting a good amount of experience though.
gonna get some good experience. Shit. I feel like I'm not getting anything good. I wish I could get down here and hit these guys. There's just one schmo here, but I'm gonna leave him for Kika. I guess I'll come down here. What I'm gonna do... I'm gonna use a flame force speed, right? I'm gonna attack you, you son of a bitch. Ah, so close. Dig. Oh, oh, there we 
we go. Tristan. Need to get that treasure. Oh, well, hopefully I can just toy with these animals. This guy, so he can't. He thinks he's getting a turning. A loser. Let's have her come over here. She'll heal up a little. Wonderful. If I stand here, can I hit? Can I hit him with the flaming arrows? No, nope, I need to be one over. Darn it. Ah, oh, whatever.
eventually we will be able to level up pretty good, but for the time being we can't do anything. Let's come over here. I want to take out you. Because the impatient man is the worst. <laughs> I guess I'll have Tristan go up. Please don't kill me. Or maybe even you, I don't care. At least you went up a level. Again, more experience stuff. No, I didn't want you to move here. No more double hitting you, son of a bitch.
Alright, done. Alright? So we have to kill that. We have to kill the old. Killer Orb, Rage Force Rune Beads. The Killer Orb is really good. I'm going to equip that as soon as I can. Whew. We better stay on our toes. Yeah, we better. This information gathering business sure is hard work. Yes, it is. It's very hard work. Now you're able to hunt monsters. Simply go to the Runes of Conobal or any other inhabited places to find them. You'll enter battle as soon as you select hunt monsters on the world map. So make sure you're fully prepared. So that's pretty nice. So anyways, let's enter that caravan. Let's uh let's let's see if I can give uh if I give what's her name that uh, that thing, can she go on that quest for me or what? Maxine? If I give you the magical cape. Oh, it doesn't bring up your magic, but it'll bring up your magic defense. That's not bad, though. Let's see. Whose magic defense is crap? Probably, uh... I'll give it a key card. I don't give a shit. And then we got a killer rune. Did anyone can... Anyone can, uh... Let's see. Anyone got an extra rune on their rune thing? Oh, Carol does. Shit, yes. I cannot wait to use this. Oh look, we get another ability. Let's see what we want to have. I guess, uh... Chance of increasing a critical hit. For Andark, I don't know what I... I guess I'm going to give him extra move. Right? That's always good to have. And Seneca, I don't know what I'm going to give you. Extra move is always good. Well, what the hell, let's run that one. And for you, let's do critical hit. up this. And that's about it. Tristan, you're good. Yeah, so he's got this thing called armor defense and shield defense. It'll actually boost up their armor. I think I think uh, Eugene has the same thing, actually. Oh, no, deflect missiles. That's pretty good. And you, you definitely want to, uh, you definitely want to, because... Eugene, he's got the uh, Firefly rune, so he can actually, like, if we look at him, what the Firefly rune does is it basically makes everyone come towards him and hit him. So, if you're going to use him in battle, which I might end up using him, he'll focus people around him, but the thing about it is, if you equip him with some of the best stuff that you get, it'll be pretty, it'll be pretty nice, and you'll be able to uh, actually dodge and... And it'll actually be pretty good because you'll be able to, uh, you'll be able to lure them towards you. So I'm going to actually stop the video here. In the next episode, we will head off to Merceto and hopefully find out what's going on there. So this has been Kenshin 1813. See you later. Bye-bye.